Kawa. Hey Tilly, have you ever been to the coast? Yes, I remember the warmth of the air and the sun shining down making everything slow and easy. I miss the sound of the water and the seabirds. Me too, Kim. But why do you ask? Oh, I ask because that's where Umra Omar grew up with her grandparents. Umra Omar? Who is that? Let me tell you all about her. Umra's grandparents raised her in the village of Chundwa. That's in Lamu County, in the sandy beaches of the warm, sunny island. Everyone in the village took care of her and made sure Umra was safe. As she got a little older, she had to leave Sunny Lamu and go to school in Nairobi. But Umra would never forget the love and the care of her people in Lamu. Did she go back to Lamu after her studies? No, her studies took her even further away, all the way to New York in the United States of America. When she was in university, she learned about the mind and the way people think. Isn't that called psychology? Yes, it is, Tilly. After that, she also learned how to make sure everyone has a chance to have a good life. She continued working in New York, using everything she'd learned to help the community around her. Even though her and her family lived far away, she never forgot about Lamu and its people. Life was going well in the big city of New York, but Umrah missed her home. So in 2015, she returned to the place she grew up. But everything had changed. What? How? The island was torn with the fight between people who wanted to hurt others and the Kenya Defense Forces who are protecting the residents of Lamu. Oh no, the fighting must have made it impossible for kids to go to school. During her visit to Lamu, Umra saw that she needed to help the people, but she couldn't do that while she was away. I'm sure Umra knew she needed to come back home, right Kim? Exactly. And that's when she had an idea for the best way to serve the people on the island. An organization of health workers and volunteers. Umra called it Safari Doctors. That's so cool. So Safari Doctors would go on safari even to the farthest parts of the island to give medical care? That's right, Tilly. Safari Doctors brought together all the people that Lamu needed, doctors, nurses and other health workers, to serve all the islands surrounding Lamu. Let me think. Doctors need medicine to give to sick people. How does the medicine get to them? Well, Tilly, it comes on airplanes, and as soon as they arrive on the mainland, many little boats pack them up to take them to different locations all over Lamu. Finally, the health workers who help the sick sometimes go to very dangerous places just to make sure the people of Lamu are healthy. Every month, they get to make sure more than 1,000 people are healthy. Wow, Umra Omar is right where she needs to be. Can you think of ways to serve and care for people around you? In 2016, Umrah received a wonderful award that called her a hero. And that's exactly what Umrah is, because of the way she has given her life and her time to take care of her community, the people of Lamu Island. Hello children, are you enjoying Hummingbird Tales? would love to hear from you. Ask your parents to send us feedback on SMS or WhatsApp on 0720-728-592 or on Power Quest Stories on social media. Pakawa. Pakawa.